at some time last year, um, KASB did an event in Russell that was about saving energy in your schools, and none of us got to go. But um, then at, I think it was the fall regional meeting, uh, this is a, you know, this whole thing came together really short, very quickly. Um, at the fall regional meeting, I think it was, there were small focus groups where you could talk about some of those issues. And, and um, I will tell you, I'm embarrassed to say, but they ask, what things are, is your school doing? You know, what, what things do you have in place? And we had none. We had not asked teachers to turn off lights. We had not asked them to shut their printers off over the weekend. We had not asked them to unplug refrigerators. We had not turned the heating and cooling down on the weekends or the, over the Christmas holiday. We had nothing in place. But we were in the middle of um, a strategic planning process and a piece of that came together with what we were doing. The leadership class had started some recycling the year before, I think, yes. Um, Justin went to a meeting to, uh, that was at the uh, state convention, wasn't it, where he went to the FCIP meeting, I think, last December. Um, so all of these things just started to pull together. And it was, it's been amazing, really, to watch. Um, Southeast is a very progressive school board and we, I think, and we are always looking for ways for us to teach our children better. Um, and so it's been an exciting, uh, an exciting process. About four or five years ago, um, our previous superintendent brought um, a proposal for replacing these 30-year-old units and the board turned it down because um, the timing wasn't right and the plan wasn't right. And um, like the uh, one lady from Tonganoxie said, this will pay for itself. This whole project will pay for itself. Plus, you didn't mention um, the, um, that we're in conversation with Mark um, to add two wind turbines. So, and we're a part of that whole grant process and those things that he talked about, this, that um, Ryan talked about this morning. So, we've got so much exciting things going on. I'm so pleased.